I'm going to cook mutter paneer today. It's uh, it's something that we find in almost every dawa, any restaurant, and it's so easy to cook that, and it's so wonderful. It just can't go wrong. So we are going to cook it, and we will learn it how to cook, and it's very simple. Just start. As usual, take some oil first. Okay, not too much. One tablespoon should be enough. Okay. And wait till the oil becomes hot. It seems already hot. And now mix garam masala. Remember, I'm using whole garam masala. You don't need to use whole garam masala. And I've also put a few pieces of ginger. If you want, if you have, and you want to use ginger garlic paste, you can also use ginger garlic paste. Or if you don't have whole garam masala, you can avoid it mixing garam masala at this moment and mix the garam masala powder in the end. So it doesn't make much difference. When it's cooked, we are going to mix some cumin seeds. Okay. And coriander powder. Ah. and put turmeric powder in it and now I am going to put tomato because I am using tin tomato and they are quite soft but if you are using fresh tomato you can make a beauty in the blender as well so it's up to you and we need to mix some salt to our taste and leave it for around two minutes so that this tomato is cooked if, if you like and you eat onion and other things you can also put chopped onion in a small pieces and put onion before uh, putting anything so in the oil so you can fry onion in the oil till it becomes brown red so it doesn't make much difference for me because I don't eat so I have just skipped as I can hear the sound that it seems is cooked now yes it is it has become puree itself and I am going to put one green chili in it and it goes if you can't cut green chili like this, don't try because it can be risky and you might cut your thumb or fingers, anything. I'm used to, so I can do it very fast. But otherwise you can use chopping board. Now this is ready. I have washed garden peas. So I'm mixing my garden peas. And now mix some water. and leave the, them for another 5 minutes so that the peas will be cooked okay from the sound it seems very obvious that everything is cooked yes we are almost there okay Our peas are cooked, so I'm going to mix paneer slices in it okay. and leave everything for another five minutes so that the paneer will also be cooked and it will soak the masala. This uh, butter paneer is ready, so what I'm going to do is I will mix a little bit of pasturi methi. It gives very good smell with the paneer dishes and just rub it with the hand and 
this that's it ah it smells so nice it's completely optional but if you want you can put one spoon of yogurt in it it gives very nice texture to mutter paneer just mix everything together okay da -da -da -da. and our mutter paneer is ready so here is our mutter paneer let me taste it dun -dun -dun. Mm. it's hot but it's trust me is better than what i was expecting it's so good and it's so easy now you can cook at your home as well and while you are cooking don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can get the new videos and see you soon